You know, Christmas is certainly a time for families to gather, often to reminisce. Tonight I have a Christmas story of a special holiday gathering with memories and pictures going back nearly a half century. It's a story of a talented Toledo kid's many moments in the national spotlight and a decision that put family above fame. He's a well-known Toledo businessman. His family name is synonymous with insurance and... I want to go back. I, I gotta, gotta go, go back, back to Ohio. Ohio State Buckeye football. But 49 years ago at Christmas, Tom Romo was getting a lot of attention for another reason. It's the Arthur Godfrey Show with Arthur Godfrey and all his little Arthur Godfreys. Tommy Romer was a child star, but his appearance on CBS's Arthur Godfrey Christmas special was buried somewhere in the network vaults until just recently. Tom's wife Vicky began a quest to find it. Months of digging paid off. The show was found, sent to us, and we invited the Romers to view it, with our cameras rolling, of course. I am so pumped. I have been so pumped to see this thing. This boy's name is Tommy Romer. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Now, uh, don't they tell me that you they call you Romeo? Yeah. Romeo Rover. <laughs> Why do they call you Romeo? Oh, because I, well, they just, maybe I'm a lover or something. No. <laughs> As a boy, Tom had entertained in Toledo, likely inheriting the performance gene from his mom, who'd been a Miss Western Pennsylvania. My dad, uh, because I used to entertain in Toledo when I was a young boy, dad one time just said, let's go to New York. <laughs> Even before this appearance in the 1958 Arthur Godfrey Christmas special, Tom had performed on the Perry Como show. He'd later play The Tonight Show with host Jack Parr. If that were today, you'd be, you'd be kicking butt on American Idol. Yeah, <laughs> right? I could. One of eight kids, Tom's path to stardom was taking shape until he learned that a job on Broadway would mean he'd miss Christmas with family in Toledo and until his dad asked for a decision. And he just said, son, you know, we're back and forth in New York. He said, you got to make up your mind. I said, I think I'll play football. Tom came home, would later attend Ohio State, marry, succeed in business, have two daughters and no regrets. I had so much fun at Ohio State and I have gorgeous daughters and they're great and so i i mean it was fun i really had a great time that rumor performance gene's been passed oh on to daughter tracy who's building an acting career in los angeles pressure girl <laughs> i know <laughs> well <laughs> it's been instilled early i mean it's emotional like i definitely like, get chills watching him even though my dad chose to not pursue acting he still has the spirit of a performer entertainer you know he's the warmest person that I know. All alone and feel <laughs> What'd you think of the boy? Thank you, honey. Oh, my pleasure. <laughs> he is as adorable now as he was then to me. He's still, I mean, I'm married to Peter Pan. <laughs> Really? He yeah, married to Peter Pan. Also appearing on that Christmas show, you had to look for her. She was a little girl sitting off the left-hand side. A little girl by the name of Patty Austin went on to become a big recording star. Recently received an Emmy nomination. Merry Christmas.